Welcome, Welcome to, to the pew. pew. <laughs> Where we have a big surprise to say at the end of the show. So, so you, you better, better stay tuned. Click <laughs> off. The show. Or we'll be clicked off. That yes. <laughs> well, um, we are celebrating an anniversary. Yes, this is my one year. Cinco de Mayo. My one year anniversary. Cinco, Cinco de Mayo. It's the one year anniversary of his return from Peru. Yes, it's been a year since I've been to Peru. And, um, and how what a year it's been. <laughs> how many times have you vomited in my apartment? Since Just then? once. Okay. Just twice. <laughs> Igor says twice. I will defer to Igor. If it's once or twice, yes, I think that's uh, some <laughs> Igor's keeping that's a running, an that's an a running tally of all the people who vomited in our apartment in the past year. And then there's been a lot, but I've only done it twice. And both for good reasons. One for the chocolate cake. And the special was, cake. What was the other reason? You were sick. The other special cake. Oh yeah, no, I was I was actually sick that time. Oh, I, I had the flu. Genuine but, illness. But um, when now when Ernie says special cake, he's making an illusion that there was drugs involved, and oh, there no. was and there was not. No, so there was a cake, and it was special. But it wasn't special K. No, I'm saying special cake. Yeah, I know you are, but you. But by saying that and then smirking, you are leading <laughs> leading the audience to believe that there was special K in the which we would never do. Which we would never do. <laughs> so Michael has gotten so much done in the year that he's been out. We were making a list of everything you've done, and, and we were just blown away. Blown away. It's quite impressive. So um, I'm writing for the New York Post, and I've got a, um, a monthly column in Gay Times, which is, I found out, the largest um, gay magazine in the world, not only in Europe, but in the world. Um, my released a, um, a video. Yes, the What's In video. What's In, What's Out, What It All, about. that reached the top of the charts. Top of the charts. Top of the, the charts bullet. in Luxembourg. With a bullet. Um, I, uh, Smallest country in Europe. Launched MichaelAlley.com. <laughs> Which was After with, with Todd uh, a six month intensive process. It took it was very intense. It was very intensive. And when you look at the site and you compare it to a lot of other sites, you see the difference. Yes. Todd really put no, it looks good. A lot of work into this with me. Um, uh, we of course are doing the pew. Which yes, we are. Where sorry. are we now? We're like at one hundred and seventy seven, I think. Yeah, something like that. Oh, no, so one hundred seventy three. We've done one hundred and seventy three episodes of the pew. Um, I booked an art an art exhibit. And it's going to be... Congratulations. I don't know if I'm allowed to give the exact date yet because I've got to deal with somebody where I have to you give know, them... legal issues, yeah. contracts, but agreements, it's going to be stipulations. I can say that it's going to be within the next two months. Um, we have <laughs> Alec Mart products. Yes, I've we opened Alec Mart and made all the products. The Which you should all buy. The keychains and the shirts and the uh, magnets and the wristbands. Lots of other fabulous All crap. those other things. Um, I've appeared in a movie, Scumbag. Not about me, <laughs> but but about another scumbag. I mean, it, I mean uh, about somebody else. Somebody who was a scumbag, <laughs> but not some, not me. Or perhaps an actual bag filled with scum. scum yes. On scum. Um, and it's an environmental film. Yes. <laughs> Um, and, um, you know, that's, that's a lot of, uh, a lot of, stay a lot of we'll shit. Be, we'll be right back. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, wait, we'll be, we'll be right back with the big surprise. Yes. Yeah, big surprise. And now a word from our sponsor. Welcome, Welcome back, back to the pew. And bitches want to know. Not that you're bitches. You are not a bitch. But some, these some people are bitches. Some those bitches want to know. What do these bitches want to know? Well, uh, Wendy Sites wants to know if you were able to collaborate at all with James St. James when he was preparing Disco Bloodbath, or is Disco Bloodbath entirely his? Perception, or should we say misperception <laughs> and interpretation? Um, or I'm, I'm surprised that misperception wasn't a club kid. <laughs> that would have been a good club kid. Um, if by collaborate you mean um, tell James what really happened and then have him write some complete fabric fabrication, then yes, I collaborated with James. 
because um, I did tell him what happened and he did not write that down. He wrote down what he wanted to write down and he added a few things like the Drano thing and the, um, um, uh, lots of, uh, you know, the Christina thing, lots of, you know, lots of things. We're going to talk about that in another, another episode, I think. Um, but, uh, well, maybe James just misunderstood what you were saying or misheard you because, like, you might have been like talking to him about something, and then you were asking a rhetorical question like, "Is he gay?" No, and then he just heard Drano. No, I, maybe maybe I was talking about a, a sink that needed to be clogged, um, and then he he accidentally put the two stories together. Yes, well, yeah, that's, okay. that's somehow that's possible. We're somehow trying to those... give we're trying to give James the benefit of the doubt here. Somehow those stories didn't sink. <laughs> <laughs> Now, and now, what about the surprise? Don't we have a surprise? Oh, yes. So we do have a surprise. The pew is moving. Where we're moving on now. Where? To the East Village. Yes, we're moving to the WOW Theater, and we expect to do that in June, early June. So stay tuned when we can tell you dates. And the great thing about this theater is that there's actual seating space for an audience. Yes, we're going to have a live audience. Right. So you can actually be in the audience to watch the pew. Um, and I guess they'll have to... And watch us fight. They will have to, <laughs> yes. They'll have to, uh, I guess, go to the uh, YouTube uh, board and like leave messages if they want to see, right? Yes, well, eventually, um, yes, we may like end up selling like priority seats for people who want to make sure that they are able to get in because we only have room for about 30 people. And uh, so all those details will be revealed in the coming weeks. Yes, but it's going to be big, big, big. See you next time. Bye.